I'm Sharice Nicole with Coco Fab TV. We're backstage at the NAACP Image Awards gifting suite, and we're going to find out what fabulous swag the winners are going home with. Follow me. Okay, so guys, we are backstage here at the NAACP Image Awards, and I ran into someone fabulous, honey. This is Josh, and he was blinging all the way from the back. So I had to find out what he was doing back here. Please tell us about your beautiful creation. Oh my gosh, thank you for all of your accolades. <laughs> <laughs> I am basically the interior designer of the gifting suite, so I create a little loungy um, space with a good vibe for people to come back and relax or do a little interview, um, that kind of thing. So for the Image Awards, I wanted something pretty glam, um, upscale, uh, lots of reflective surfaces to check that hair and makeup, you know, when you need to do <laughs> on the side. But um, we can come on back. Uh, I, I chose a really neutral palette, um, very tonal. There's lots of silvers and creams and it's something that everyone will look good in for pictures. Um, and uh, especially if you've got some, like if you're in a, a ball gown that's red, it's going to really pop against this neutral background, but still have some great glitzy, glamorous elements. Now you are someone special, if I recall. I think he's somewhat of a celebrity, am I correct? Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, well, in some parts I'm known as Sparkle Josh, if you can <laughs> t take all that in. Um, I have uh, Worked for HGTV um, and been a contestant and a host and a judge for uh, and a, a personality for them on air for the last on and off for the last seven years. Who's been the most exciting person so far? Well, I have to tell you that um, a couple of years ago at the Image Awards in 2010, um, I'm sorry, 2011, uh, Miss Vanessa Williams came in and she knew who I was. Oh my God. Melted, I can die. Yeah, and of course we all, we um, had, we talked about pageants and like gowns and all that kind of stuff. That was the, the first thing, but just because she knew who I was from the network, Macy TV and, and the Design Star show that I was on, like I was just melted, like I, I could really die now. So that was my most ex <laughs> exciting experience. Safe, guys, and I heard some beautiful music coming from this table over here. And I, ca I came over here and I said, Who is this handsome man? This is Big Rich, and he is going to tell us about the fabulous headphones that we have behind us. So, this is Bigger Audio, a company that we started about three years ago. What we decided to do was to make a fashion forward headphone with an environmental twist. Our headphones are also, from the environmental standpoint, from our plastics to our leathers to everything about them is environmentally friendly. Can I put one of them on? Sure. Oh my God, so these were made for me. You know why? Because when I put them on, you know what song I'm listening to right now? I woke up like this. <laughs> I woke up like this. <laughs> what would be the ideal celebrity for you to have these on? I would probably say Dre the rapper. He has his own headphone line, but I think once he tries ours, he might uh -oh. he might enjoy them. Uh -oh. <laughs> There's some competition here. He said, Dre, you need to get down here and try these headphones. You're going to be jealous. If there was a female, a pop star, an actress, something, and she was going to be standing here in a bikini with these headphones on, who would that be? Holly Berry. Oh. Is that a good call? That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Rich, that's what I'm talking about. Halle Holly Berry. Holly, if you want a set of headphones, please call me. here at the NAACP Image Awards and I was wondering what time it was and what do you know my handy dandy Swiss watch is gonna tell me this is one of the fabulous gifts that they are giving all of the celebrities the winners the nominees here tonight and I am so lucky to have one on my wrist right now I don't know if I should actually be touching these but luckily nobody's looking right now so we're gonna ease over here to the men's watches I might have to pick one of these up for one of my boos. I mean, there's so many. Denzel, I don't know which one I'm gonna choose tonight. Maybe Idris Elba. I think Idris might like one of these over here. These are the red line watches. These are absolutely stunning as well. I'll wait and see which one they pick up, and then I'll let you guys know. We'll just keep it between the two of us. But for now, I'm just gonna sneak off with this watch in my hand. Don't tell anybody. Sharice, 
I just want to say thank you and to the rest of the Coco Fab team for being very supportive and showing us lots of love. What we have here is Hairfinity, which is a vitamin that you take. It's a supplement. You take two a day, um, and um, after 30 days, you'll start seeing results. You will start seeing your hair be a little bit stronger, less breakage, less shedding. Um, it's one of the best products right now out in the market. Um, there's not too many people that have really discovered the secret of taking care of your body from the inside out like we have. I'm doing a challenge um, with our brand ambassador, Keisha and I Pulliam. Uh-oh, Keisha! Yes, and so we're inviting all of our consumers to do a six-month challenge. And so I wanted to be authentic, and so I cut my hair four inches. And so in six months, I expect to have... If not my four inches, like three. Wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. Leslie, you are telling me that you cut four inches off yes. of your hair, and you know it takes like four years for black people to grow four inches. So you yes. think your hair is going to go four inches in only six months? I believe my hair is going to grow four inches in six months. That is, that is truly a celebrity secret. You can grow your hair in four inches in six months and not have to have Indian hair in there. Honey, I don't yeah, know. I what other celebrities use your product? Um, we just had um, Taraji um, did an article last December in Us Weekly mentioning Hairfinity as one of her favorite five. Um, Regina King, she, you know, has been a supporter. We've loved her. Um, and just several other women, you know, that we know. Thank you guys so much. And we look forward to finding out what happens with the Hairfinity Challenge. Sparkle Josh Johnson and you're watching Coco Fab TV.